Oh my god. We're back, everybody, with more super sexy, seductive Valentine's Day stream 2024. It's still ongoing, if you can believe it. Holy shit. Um, we've got more stuff to do. Oh boy. Now, here's the thing. Do I want to do the Flash game, or do I want to do Doomed Love? Oh, if it takes like 12 hours, he might be in trouble. Uh, I mean, I've, I've done most of what we were going to do on this list. I just didn't finish Kata with Shoujo, so we're doing pretty good. Um... Yeah, let's try Doomed Love, I guess. It's another text visual novel, but maybe it won't be as long as Katawa Shoujo, so... I mean, it is a free game. Oh, wait, Katawa Shoujo is a free game as well. Fuck, alright. <laughs> Forget it then. Um, I think it's widescreen, so we'll keep our widescreen chat. And, um... Let me just see if I can find this game. Um, alright, Doomed Love. Let's see how that goes. Um... So, yeah, basically, uh, Doom Universe dating sim. Uh, it's, it, it's something that someone made. Someone did this, so we're gonna do it. <laughs> Look, if I get to fuck a caco, I'm gonna be in a very good mood. So, let's do that. Uh, there we go. Doomed Love by David Cooper. <laughs> oh my god, he's got the flowers, he's got the alcohol, he's got a mixtape, he's got a letter, some, some chocolates... A teddy bear. Oh my goodness. So many demons. The dude goes like, ah, oh, okay, sure. About. Version 1.1, made by David Cooper. This is an unofficial fan game made without Bethesda's authorization. But just be cool, okay? This program contains free software, etc., etc. Software license, da, da, da. All right. Full screen, unseen text, after... Okay, no, that's all fine. We haven't seen anything just yet. Help. Uh, enter advances dialogue, Katal skips dialogue while held down, Top tab is, okay, so it uses the same system as Kata with Shoujo. Let's go. Careful, you're gonna rip it. Don't tear it. I was starting to feel like this whole thing had been a mistake. Time to rip and tear. Oh. It was the last day before the Icon of Sin Festival, and things were getting intense. Cacodemon had gotten four friends, Revenant, Man Mancubus, Demon, and myself, Zombie Man, to finish the last of the decorations. Oh, we're not the Doom guy. This is the last one, be careful. I am being careful, you such a control freak. I am not. I just need all this to be perfect, and I'm the only one here that can ensure that. Everything needs to be fabulous for the festival. If this turns into Doki Doki Literature Club with Doom characters, I'm fine with it. I'm absolutely thrilled with that. It's fine. We're basically done. It looks fine, right, zombie man? Yeah, we've done the hard work. Time to party. Not for me. I have to go home and practice my trumpet solo a few hundred more times. Yeah, Revenant needs to do... What? You still need to practice? I do not need to practice. You don't. You do not need to practice more, Revenant. You've done your solo a million times over. I could still screw up. You won't. I covered the last papier mache severed head in glue and started to cover it in glitter. <laughs> glitter. Okay. So it's a severed head, but um, it's a papier mache uh, severed head. But you know, we're going to put some glitter on it. We're going to make it look nice. So does anyone have a date for tomorrow? <laughs> Hmm. Uh, uh, I guess none of us do. We're gonna look like a bunch of losers. Cyberdemon's gonna laugh at us so hard, and the Icon of Sin will never put us in charge of decorations again. Oh, it's gonna be Principal Icon of Sin, isn't it? Calm down, Cacodemon, it's not that bad. We'll have fun. Yeah, it's supposed to be a celebration, not a stress arama. <laughs> this isn't the master levels or anything. There are already going to be a lot of demons there. We don't need to, to bring our personal demons as well. Oh, snap, he did the thing. It'd be nice to, to have a date, though. Maybe I'll entice someone with my trumpet playing. Haha, <laughs> you will need to practice more if that's your goal. Everyone laughed. I playfully punched Mancubus in the arm. Haha, <laughs> shut up. Pass me the poster paint, will you? Here you go. Oh! Swinging his flamethrower arm wildly, Mancubus knocked the bottle over. The green paint spilled out, covering the banner we had spent an hour finishing. Oh uh, No! What have you done? Uh, I'm, I'm so sorry, I just... You ruined the event. 
this was my one chance at impressing the icon of sin. You idiot. Calm down, Cacodemon. It was an accident. It can be easy to make mistakes with those flamethrower arms, I'll bet. No. I don't care. I don't care. I don't even have arms, and you don't see me ruining everything like this. <laughs> That's a good point. It's just one banner we can do without. Amateurs. You're all amateurs. No wonder you can't get dates. That's, uh, uh, them's fighting words there, buddy. Don't make me go over there and fucking tear your eye out. Cacodemon stormed out into the backstage area, uh, floating angrily through the doorway. Demon followed. Hey, wait up. I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. Uh, it's okay, Cacodemon just needs to cool off a bit. Are you okay? I, I will be. Mm, stay with Mancubus and Revenant, or go check on Cacodemon and Demon. <laughs> uh, let's go with Cacodemon and Demon, because, you know, gotta fuck that Cacodemon. Mancubus would be okay. Um, I just need to check that Cacodemon wasn't going to have a meltdown. Okay, I'm going to check on the others. You guys can tidy up, right? You got it. Thanks. I left. I heard Cacodemon sobbing by the uh, backstage entrance. Or is that exit? I, I was reading too fast. It's not important. We have enough. I know. It's just the pressure gets to me sometimes. And Hey, guys. Oh, hi, zombie man. Hey, don't... Hello, don't worry. I think I'm okay. I just got a little overwhelmed with it all back there. Don't worry. It's been a long week. But it all... But it'll all be worth it tomorrow. Cacodemon smiled. Yeah. Just then, Cyber Demon, Baron of Hell and Hell Knight, burst through the back door. Uh oh, are these the bullies? Are you jerks still here? Jeez, give it a rest. The festival isn't going to be any fun with you organizing. You might as well give up. Huh, <laughs> yeah, huh, huh, huh. For the information, Cyber Demon, for your information, Cyber Demon, we are all done here and it looks amazing. Unlikely. The Icon of Sin is going to put me in charge next year for. For sure, after this year is a drag. Oh, you tell him, boss. Well, I guess we'll see. But you'll be sorry when. Did someone say something, or was it just an insignificant speck? I don't recall addressing you, lowly demon. You're too low on the pecking order for me to care about anything you have to say. Hey, that's not nice. And a zombie man too. Of the of the hundreds of zombie men. Jeez, you guys really are the loser brigade. Get out of here, Zyber Demon. With pleasure. See you at the festival, dateless wonders. <laughs> yeah, bye. <laughs> they left the way they came in. Demon looked hurt and Cacodemon's scales were rolled up again. Uh, we'll show him. There's nothing more we can do here anyway. We might as well get some rest. I suppose so. I'm going to grab a bite to eat. You coming, Demon? Demon snapped out of their thoughts. Oh. Huh? Oh, uh, thanks. I'm gonna go for a walker, I think. Clear my head a little. Suit yourself. What about you, zombie man? Oh god, the music is just sound effects from the game. Uh. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Suit yourself. What about you, zombie man? Uh, get some food with Caco Demon, go for a walk with Demon. Let's get some food! All that decorating mate had made me hungry. I could do with a bite to eat. See you tomorrow, Demon? Uh, oh, I thought I was going for Caco Demon. Yeah, see ya! Yay, let's go to Impies! Oh, okay, we're going with Caco Demon. There we are. It was a short walk to Impies, the local diner. The place was a favourite among the inhabitants of Hell because it served quality food at reasonable prices. As many learned, their milkshakes were to die for. Ugh, I'm so hungry, I can consume thy flesh. <laughs> Just kidding. The owner, Impy, approached our booth. Hey there, what can I get you? Mm. I'll take a carcass of rotting flesh, extra crispy, please. Uh, you got it, and you? I'll have the Inferno Special... Uh, mm, the Inferno Special, please. Coming right up. Impy disappeared into the kitchen. <laughs> you seem in a better mood, Caco Demon. Oh, I always feel better at Impy's. I have to admit, it is good quality food at reasonable prices. It's fabulous. I do feel bad about yelling at Mancubus, though. I hope he forgives me. 
He will, don't worry. I just want this to be the best festival ever. We need to show Cyber Demon how, how great we did. I got a feeling this isn't just about Kaka, the, the Cyber Demon. Kaka Demon furrowed their, eye, their brow, their one singular brow. How do you mean? You put so much pressure on yourself, it, it, it can't feel nice. Hmm, I, I just have high standards, that's all. My parents raised me that way. Ask Kakadim about their parents. Ask Kakadim about their standards. Uh, let's go standards. Why did you give yourself such high standards? You're so motivated, it's exhausting to watch. The best efforts deliver the best results, of course. I don't think I could live with myself if I didn't give, uh, give it my all. Hmm. But after that point, uh, well, didn't your surroundings ever get in the way of your happiness? What good is success if you can't enjoy it? I'll enjoy my success once I've achieved them. There will always be another hill to climb. Maybe the journey is more important than the destination after all that. Yeah, you would say that. You don't have any legs. Well, for now, I intend to enjoy this delicious meal. Impy arrived with our food. Enjoy! Oh, I intended to. Uh, oh, I intend to. Thank you. With alarming speed, Kakademon devoured their food, barely stopping to chew. I found myself wondering it, where it went, uh, where it went, He, but pushed that thought out of my head. Oh, delicious. I agree. Although, I'm still working on mine. One cling a plate already? What a compliment. It's delicious, Impy. It always is. How do you do it? Well, the key ingredient is, is to love what you do. That's my secret ingredient. Love. And, of course, not taking things too seriously. Accept your cleaning policies, right? Um, yeah, right. <laughs> no salmonella in the last four weeks. It's great. Impy, sh it's Im Impy shuffled back into the kitchen. You see, there's a guy who doesn't put too much pressure on himself. Uh, I see that you're getting a zombie man. I, I see what you're getting at, zombie man, but... Well, but de everyone is different. What works for Impy might not work for me, and I need to push myself as far as I can to achieve the best. Hmm. Okay, you should work yourself even harder then. Just don't pressure yourself too much, okay? I care about you, Kakademon. I don't want you to work yourself to death. You're too young to die. Okay, point taken. I'll start by enjoying the festival tomorrow. It's gonna be a double barrel blast. Ooh, sounds like a good time. It sure is. We put in the fireworks. We, uh, what? we deserve a fun time. Plus, we get to show that stupid cyber demon how great we did. Ha <laughs> ha ha. Don't worry about that, jerk. You know, we could really show him if we arrived with dates. I know. What if we. What if you and I went together? <laughs> you know what we're missing, Eddie? Uh, you know, a, a, a nice bird with massive knockers. You've been saying that for the past 20 years. <laughs> oh dear. Like a date? Yeah, that could be fun. What do you say? Uh, we don't need to go uh, as each other's dates to have fun. Oh, fuck it. Let's go. There we go. Kakademon practically leapt out of the booth. Fabulous. Oh, I am so glad you said yes. We're going to have a great time. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a fun time. Hmm. Just tell me why you don't put as much pressure on yourself when you, with dates as you do with everything else. Cacodemon smirked. Dates are supposed to be fun, silly. Don't worry, you'll see a relaxed Cacodemon tomorrow. Hmm. Just after we do the last minute touches on the decorations. Oh, brother. Well, we paid for the food and said goodnight. So, let's get going. I barely slept that night. I was too excited for the festival. I got there. I got the the uh, early the next day to help with the last minute preparations. You're here! Yay! I wouldn't miss it for the world. What can I do to help? Cacodemon beamed. Uh, nothing. Uh, hmm. Nothing. We're all ready to go, baby. Oh, that's great. You're prepared. Prepared for an amazing date. What the fuck is this? We made our way uh, out into the festival property as demons started coming in. Okay. Uh, this is where it's all... Uh, this is where it's all worth it. Time to have some fun. We watched Revenant's performance together. We danced, we laughed. 
have to admit Cacodemon knew how to throw a party. Later in the night, Cyberdemon found us enjoying the blood fountain. Uh, hey. Hey, Cyberdemon, having fun? Well, uh, yeah. I just wanted to come by and say, uh, good job. Don't mention it. Cyberdemon awkwardly shuffled away. Did you see that? We showed him, uh, we certainly showed him. We sure did. On tonight is just, is, on, oh, oh, tonight is just the best. It sure is. We laughed together and noticed a mancubus, uh, mancubus sitting alone at the side. Hey buddy, sorry about yesterday. Huh? Eh? Oh, it's okay, it was my fault. Uh, no, I shouldn't have freaked out like that. It's, it's okay, really, under the water under the bridge. Mancubus seemed to suddenly notice that Cacodemon and I hadn't uh, left each other's side all evening. Hey, do you guys have something to tell me? Uh, well, um, yes, Zombie Man and I are having a date and it's just the most wonderful night. Haha, <laughs> okay, don't let me get in the way of that then. Cacodemon was hyper the rest of the evening, clearly enjoying the fruits of their labour. They spoke to everyone they could, lighting up the room. But soon, the night had to end and Demon started to leave. Hmm. We began by cleaning out the mess, still smiling as we did. Why am I summoning fire, assuming that's me? Okay, uh, we are tired but we are happy. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> Alright, it's a caco, a gong thing and a guy without pants. I don't know what's happening anymore. Well, it's safe to say this was a success. Uh, I'd, I'd have to agree with that. Uh, thanks, zombie man. I couldn't have done it without you. Oh, is that it? I'm not sure I agree. Uh, I'm not sure uh, I agree with, but it's amazing. You're amazing. I am. But maybe we both are. I still don't think that you should have put so much pressure on yourself. Oh, that's right. I'm zombie man. I, it took me a million years to figure out who the fuck that was. But it all paid off. Well, what do you mean, well? Are you saying the evening hasn't been magnificent? No, no, nothing like that. It's been wonderful. It's just that, uh, what? Well, I think that uh, any uh, evening with you would be wonderful. Cacodemon, harsh, uh, harsh defenses instantly melted. Oh, Cacodemon smiled. We'll just wait. You'll see how wonderful our second date is. Oh god, it's going to be very weird. Thanks for playing our game. Oh, that's it. Congratulations, you got the Caco Demon ending. He is best girl all the time. Oh, should we go for another one? It's so very short, we should go for another one. Let's go... Um, preferences. Who gives a shit? Um, yeah, no, all these options are fine. Alright, let's go back to... Oh, okay, no, that's that. That's that. Um... How do I go back to the main menu on this shit again? Oh. Oh, we've got main menu. Uh, yes. I need to worry about that. That's good. We didn't even make any saves, so it's kind of pointless. Alright, careful, we're gonna rip it. Don't tear it. <laughs> Alright, let's pick another route this time. It was the last day before the Icon of Sin Festival. Uh, let's see what we haven't done yet, because the story's so short we can just skip through all this stuff. Alright, stay with Magcubus and Revenant. Go check on Cacodemon and Demon. Let's go with Magcubus and Revenant. Magcubus said they were fine, but the tears in their eyes indicated otherwise. I won't tell anybody. Uh, but we were almost done anyway. Ah, we can live without one batter. Uh, uh-huh. It was, it was really an accident. Sometimes these things are hard to control. I'm such a klutz. These things happen, and we're all so used to uh, to visited ra what? violent rampages. Occasionally, we're going to mess something up. Oh, right, they're doom monsters. That's right. Yeah, you can't believe. Oh, you, you can't. Oh, well, sorry. Yeah, you can't have a, a hell dimension without crushing a few skulls. Here, here. Mancubus smiled a little. The three of us uh, started to clean up the mess. As we were putting together the arts and crafts supplies, uh, a soul... Uh, whoop, a soul? Oh, a lost soul peeked through the door. What the fuck is wrong with me? <laughs> I should know all these things. There's a lost soul. Ah. 
Oh, hi, I didn't realize you was all still here. If if I leave you the blue key card, will you lock up before you go? It's okay, I think we're done here. We'll just leave. We'll leave just now. I hadn't realized how late it was. I'd better go home and practice. Hmm. I could do with an audience when it comes to my solo gig, zombie man. Um. I could do with the audience. Maybe come listen to my solo, zombie man. Hmm. Uh, spend time with Mar Mancubus and check they're okay. Or listen to Revenant practice t trumpet. Or let's go with... Let's go with a Mancubus for now. Mancubus still looked upset from before. Thanks for the other Revenant. I think we're going to have to hang out for a bit and relax. Good luck, though. I think you're you're going to be... Uh, I think you're going to be great. Oh, thanks. See you at the at the festival. Revenant left and Mancubus uh, oh, turned to face me. So, uh, what do you want to know? I don't know. I just thought it would be fun to chill out for a bit. We found a pretty busy week. I know just the place. Oh, Mancubus took me to a specific location near a toxic waste dump. A small river of green ooze flowed past us. Mancubus sat on the edge and dipped his feet in. What is this place? Oh, just a second. Uh, spot, I already, what? Just a, oh, just a secluded spot I go to every now and then. Sometimes I like the quiet. It kind of smells a little, don't you think? Does it? I hadn't noticed. Maybe I'm used to it. Hmm, please, I don't, I don't have nostrils. Uh, okay. Mancubus licked their feet, splashing the ooze, uh, splashing the ooze a little. What the fuck are you doing? I had to admit, it was peaceful, despite the smell. It really was an accident back there, you know. I know. Sometimes people can, can't see the difficulties others face. Us Mancubus about having flamethrowers, us, uh, No, we'll talk about flamethrower arms. There we go. It must be cool having flamethrower arms, though. Oh, it is, but... But it's really hard sometimes. B burning your, your arms to a crisp so you can hear the, the, the flesh melt uh, from them is pretty bloody cool and all. But sometimes I just want to hold a glass of water with a... Ooh. I just want to hold a glass of water without spilling it all over the kitchen counter. Uh... There we go. Pop that over there. Yeah, I understand. You don't. This world hasn't uh, wasn't designed for people like me. Mancubus's face masked a lifetime of pain as they shook. Uh, they they, they, whoop, they looked at their arms. You're right. We don't need to think about how things might be for harder. Uh, things might be harder for you. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, you're a good listener, zombie man. Thanks. Anytime. Well. I, I, I'm sorry for being such a downer. It's just been a rough day. Yeah, I'll fucking say it. Sometimes I wish I weren't so hideous. You're not hideous. You're perfect just the way you are. Being hideous is just who you are. Let's go with the top answer. Okay. Mancubus stood up uh, in the river away from the toxic waste. A puzzled man... A puzzled look on his face. You, you mean, you mean that? I really do. I reach my, I, uh, I reached my hand out and placed it on their flamethrower. You're beautiful inside and out. That's the first time anyone's ever said that. Uh, I'm glad I brought you here. Thank you. Why does that keep moving? There we go. I'm glad too. I almost wish we could stay here forever. I don't want to go to the festival tomorrow. It's really not my scene. Neither is this. We could find your scene together. Suddenly, Mancubus appeared bashful. Oh, zombie man, I don't suppose... Maybe we could skip the festival and go on a date instead? Okay. I think you've messed around with my signs. Thank you. No, thank you. I would love that, yes. Mancubus seemed surprised by my answer. What? Really? That, that sounds lovely. Hmm, okay. Uh, we have earned a nice date together with friends. Oh, yeah. We, we don't have to be like everyone else. We can be ourselves, unique and beautiful. 
Let's go have a picnic on Mars. Great idea, I'll bring some sandwiches and- No, leave the food to me. Leave everything to me. No, leave the food to me. Everything, uh, leave everything to me. Oh, I read that. Okay, if you're sure. Mancubus seemed nervous, but happy. We we went out, uh, out, we went our separate ways. Excited for tomorrow. Oh boy. We're gonna fuck that big boy. The next day I woke up early. I thought I'd be excited for the festival, but I was now looking forward to something else entirely. Oh yeah. I used the nearest, I used the nearest star. What? I used the nearest teleporter to head to Mars. Oh. Oh, right, Doom. Sorry, sometimes I forget that's the universe we're in. Mancubus was already there, waiting. They had some flowers ready for me, and a basket. Uh, hi? Hi? Listen, uh, you can... Uh, you can back out of this if you'd like. Uh, but, well, if we head back now, we, we can still make the festival and... Uh, oh, I, I interrupted Mancubus by placing my hand on their flamethrower arm. Don't be silly, there's nowhere else I'd rather be. I'm so glad. We strolled in the hot Mars sun for hours, uh, for an hour. Um, what? We strolled in the hot sun for a while. Hand in flamethrower. Oh, okay. Until we found a nice shady crater to settle in. Mancubus spread the blanket out and reached in the basket. Uh, stand back a second, will you? <laughs> oh, oh, it's big. I watched as Mancubus pulled out a bunch of sausages on a skewer, balanced it on one arm, and flashed, uh, flash fried it with, uh, with the other, giving them instantly, uh, cook, grilling them instantly to perfection. <laughs> oh wow! Here you go! They handed me a portion of sausages and I took a bite. Wow, delicious! Thanks, I made them myself from the flash, uh, the flash of the damned. Huh, the flash of the damned, what the fuck is that? Uh, mm, you can really taste the torment. <laughs> we will miss the we uh, we didn't miss the festival after all. We didn't miss the festival at all. We spent the day there in peace and quiet, eating, laughing, and having a good time. Hey, zombie man. Yeah. Thanks for doing this with me, even if it is a pity date. It's not a pity date. I'm glad you asked. Uh, me too. You're a great person, Mancubus. You shouldn't put yourself down, uh, down that much. Well, it's difficult sometimes. Well, h help me help you by... Ooh, let's see. Oh, let me help you then. Mancubus stopped eating for a second and took this in. Then they smiled. Okay. It was the small first step, but it was the only... It was the first of many. Oh, dear. It's... Yeah, I mean, it's not exactly space exploration, but I'll, I'll take it. Congratulations, you got the Mancubus ending. Thank you for playing our game. Uh, it seems like there's multiple endings. Should we just keep going through all of them? It's kind of short. I guess so. Oh yeah, that just goes back to the main menu. And if I go load... So there's no auto saves in this game. Uh, how do I... Oh, there we go. Oh, just hit start, right? Alright, let's skip some dialogue we've already seen. Oh, it goes very fast. Um, okay, let's dude it up with the Revenant, why not? Yeah. Stay with- oh, I didn't click it. Stay with Mancubus and Revenant. Mancubus uh, said they were fine, but the, the tears in their eyes indicated otherwise. Oh, we can skip that too. Listen to Revenant's, uh, Revenant practice trumpet. Yay, dude time! Yeah, okay, Revenant, I'll listen to you play. Great, you want to come to Mancubus? No thanks, I'm going to go get some rest. Okay, see you tomorrow. After a lovely evening walk, punctured by screams and and uh, burning in the astral, uh, astral what? In the eternal law of, fl of lava, we made it back to the Reven back to Revenant's home. So here we are, my humble abode. Uh, I'm not going to show you. Uh, I'm not going to show you what I'm performing. Tomorrow, don't judge too harshly, okay? Oh, he's going to show me. Never mind, I misread that. I'm sure it'll be fine, but it wasn't fine. It was much better than that. Revenant's trumpet recital was the stuff of legends. Every note, a work of art. Every bar, a, a symphony, transcends the movie itself. It's all, all too sudden. The performance has stopped. I had tears in my eyes. 
So, what did you think? Oh, Remnant, that was amazing. People are going to be stunned. No, I messed up a little at the end there. Cool. Uh, cool. Let me try again. They played their trumpet again, and despite being note perfect once again, it sounded fresh and beautiful to my ears. Whoever it was, I applaud. Hashtag not a developer. When it was over, I applauded. You're incredible. I need some more practice. You too, you're too much of a perfectionist. If I just go through it, throw it a few more times, I know I can... Oh. Oh. Stop, you're already perfect. I could listen all day, but I think you need a break. Maybe you're right. We got some snacks and hung out for a bit. What does a revenant eat, do you think? It's gotta be something. Uh, ask Revenant about their trumpet playing. Ask Revenant what they will do with their life. Ask them about trumpet. So Revenant, what made you want to learn to play trumpet? Well, to be honest, I don't really remember. I played since I was very young. Apparently I just had that drive from an early age. Do you still enjoy it after all this time? Uh, of course. <laughs> but it's not, it's not about... But, uh, of course, but it's, it's, it's not about enjoying at this point, really. It's about striving to be the best. Best? I, I, I mean, can you, can, can you be the best at music? Everyone has their taste, right? Hell yes, I suppose so. But I'm gonna aim for the stars anyway. Oh no, look at the time. We've been yapping so long, I need to... I, I, I need to get my trumpet solo right. It's already perfect. No, you don't understand. Even the slightest mess can ruin everything. Never mind. I worried you. I worry you too much with your, with your, uh, uh, with uh, what? I worry you might be too much of a perfectionist. Oh God! Why am I finding it so hard to read all of a sudden? You're already the best trumpet player I've ever heard. What more can you do? I can be better, of course. If I could just get this performance right. Don't worry about perfection. You're you're great the way you are. That's right. You should keep going for it. It has to be perfect. Nah, you're fine. Revenant, it's okay. You don't have to obsess. If you're already great, and even if you weren't, it wouldn't be the stress that you're putting yourself through. Revenant calmed down, but the trumpet put the trumpet down and smiled. You mean it? Yeah, being happy is more important than being perfect. I don't think anyone's ever told me that before. Hmm, no one's ever put my personal uh, well-being over my craft. Hmm. Thank you, zombie man. Maybe we should get Bible man out here as well. Oh, don't mention it. Revenant looked at the, uh, looked off towards the the flames, resorting it, uh, what, what, rising in the flower in the hor horizon, uh, horizon. Oh. Oh god, can't read. Revenant looked off towards the flames rising on the horizon, consuming the mortals. Yay! He took. D he looked deep in thought. After a moment, he turned back to me and asked, Hey, zombie man, after the festival, do you maybe want to hang out? Like a high bridge with no railings? <laughs> well, I'd love to go on a date with you. I'm flattered, but no thank you. There we go. No, go on another date with him. Very easy. A big grin appears across Revenant's skeletal face. Really? That's great. If played, a Schrodinger's cat, uh... What? They played a short celebratory few notes on their trumpet. Why did I read that as Schrodinger's cat? <laughs> Let's make the festival our first official date. Haha, aren't you forgetting you'll be busy? Oh, reinvent looked down at his trumpet. Oh yeah. No matter, we can hang out uh, after the performance. No wait, I have a better idea. Alright, me meet me, oh, meet me backstage before the show starts, okay? Alright, what are you planning, Revenant? You'll see. Revenant had a sly smirk on his face, and he led me led me out so he could uh, practice more, and went home. The next day I woke up early, excited for the festival. Oh god, is it really talking over the credits? Is that a glitch? Um, oh wait, those aren't credits, those are the options down there. I can't see over my microphone at all. Uh, the next day I woke up early, excited for the festival. Okay, so many people here, ready for the celebration of their lives. After some polite he he hellos, I headed backstage to meet Revenant. Oh, and then shoot him in the face. They were, they, 
there are, oh, there were so many demons rushing about to make things, uh, to make the night go without a hitch. But Revenant has no, has nowhere to be seen. Apparently they can't do it. At his curtain call, uh, as his curtain call approached, I got more and more nervous for them until, hey, sorry I'm late. Revenant, it's almost time for you to play. I know, I know, I was just getting, uh, just getting some last minute rehearsals in. So, with a... Okay, so what was your big deal? You'll see. Just stand over there a second, please. I'm gonna die, aren't I? I walked over to the side of the stage at a certain open... Opened having a, a jog to a little path... Uh, without... A little path to enjoying it without it being seen. Oh, so they got, like, camera footage of it and they just couldn't scrap it? Okay. Oh. All of a sudden, the crowd fell silent. The Revenant stood there, alone, on the stage. Hello, everyone. Thanks for coming tonight. Crowd cheered. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> that excites Caddy. I'm very excited to play for you, but uh, I'd like to introduce someone who helped me get here. My eyes widened. Please, give me a warm welcome to... Nope. Uh, there we go. Uh, please give a warm welcome to Zombie Man. Before I knew what was happening, Revenant took me by the hand and walked me into the center of the stage. Uh, he's the loudest of all. Ready? I smiled and nodded. The thrill was exhilarating. Here we go. Uh, so much homoerotism. Uh, I knew everyone. Uh, I knew every note having heard the, uh, the rehearsal of the I was able to dance alongside uh, it in a, in a way that uh, drove the crowd wild. <laughs> Good old droids. The music with my Im improvised dance, it was magical. Maybe I should have been embarrassed, but with Revenant b by my side, all, all, all was lost. Just, I lost all inhibitions. The performance was the most perfect moment of my undead life. It could have lasted forever, but... Uh, Oh, eventually it had to end. And it was only 20 seconds. Thank you. Thank you all so much. Enjoy your night. Uh, I'm not sure the crowd heard Revenant over their excitement. Curtains closed and Revenant turned to me, so I guess that's good. So did you enjoy that? Oh, Revenant, that was amazing. Thank you so much. Okay. For the rest of my... What is that picture down there? For the rest of my year... There we go. I'll move that over there as well. Uh, for the rest of my years, the only thing I remember more fondly than being on that stage was the smile on Ra Raven Alt's face uh, in the moment. It was the smile on... Wait, did I... I think I skipped that, did I? What's going on with this dialogue? For the rest of my years, the only thing I remembered more fondly than being on that stage was the... Oh, was the smile on Remnant's face that moment. There he is. Congratulations, you got the Revenant ending. Thanks for playing our game. Alrighty, um, main menu. There's only one of them left now. Um, uh, are you sure you want to return to, yeah, okay. All right, let's do another launch. Uh, hmm. We don't really have breakable weapons in this, but we do have this irritating thing where, uh, they start to lose their effect a bit, but that's right. It's the last day before the icon. Oh, I can skip it. Yep. Now let's see. We've had Mancubus, Revenant, Kaka Demon, and not uh, not regular demon. So here we go. Here we go. And I can skip this again and then just go with the regular demon. Here we go. I'm okay. Thanks for the offer, Kaka Demon. Uh, demon, would you mind if I joined you on your walk? Oh, okay. It might be nice to have some company. Suit yourself. We left the venue uh, ready for the following day. Um, oh dear. Uh, Demon and I used a teleporter to travel to Mars. A vast red desert lay before us, ready for a pleasant stroll. On the horizon, you see... Uh, on the horizon, we can see a Phobos lab. But we are more interested in absorbing the solar rays, as it was the middle of the Mars day. 
I wonder, if, I wonder what the uh, day and night cycle is for Mars. I've never actually checked that. Because I know, I know some things. I know, like, you know, winter is just always cold at the, at the poles, and summer's always got the sun up. And you should wear sunscreen if you ever go there, because uh, you know, that daily sun is ridiculous. But I wonder what the, the day and night cycle for Mars is. Demon, you're awfully quiet today. The, sorry, I just have much to say right now. Oh? Oh. It's okay, did Cyber Demon get to you? No. Well, okay, maybe a little. He had a point after all. There are so many of us demons out there. Thousands, if not millions, all across the depths of hell. It just makes you feel so insignificant. No demons quite like you, buddy. Remember that. How do you know? Look out there, into the vastness of space. There's so much out there. Uh, not getting any info. Oh, no, I don't know about Mars day and night cycles. Oh, maybe I... Oh, well, I misspelled it, so maybe that was it. I'm trying to multitask. It ain't going so well. <laughs> um, hang on, maybe if I go Mars day and There we go. Try that out. How long is a day on Mars? Um, uh, it doesn't move at a constant. Oh, well, it's spinning. So roughly the same at 23 hours and 56 minutes. Um, if that's to be believed, if that's accurate, then sure. Okay, so it's about the same then. Good to know. So we've got a little less time in our day. Uh, in a universe of infinite possibilities, how can I be anything less than average? How will the icon of sin ever be, uh, ever be a uh, pros of someone as painfully normal as me? Hey, now you're talking baby talk. Um, you're talking to a zombie man here. I get where you're coming from. But even so, you've, uh, you're not nobody. No, you're not nobody. Nobody's in chat. <laughs> you're special to your friends. Despite his best efforts, Demon could not hide a, hide a flash of a smile. Uh, ask him about his own aspirations. Ask Demon about his relationship with Cyber Demon. No, just ask him about his own aspirations. Where's my mouse cursor? Oh, there it is. Fuck. Forget about what you are. What do you want to be? What do you mean? Well, you're more than just a demon. If you could be anything else, what would you be? Hmm. Ooh. Demon looked up to up to me at the sky. Oh, Demon looked up at the sky. He seemed to contemplate its vast infin infinite infinity for a for a minute. Oh, I've always liked the stars. Maybe I could study them, like an astronomer. Yeah, that's it. Well, that sounds amazing. You know, the stars may all look the same, but when you look closer, there are millions of differences between them. It just takes a little observation. Laying on a little thick, aren't we? Ugh. The point is that there's more to you than just being a demon. If that's what you want, you're the one that's that's ever believed that. Well, you're the only one that's ever believed that zombie man. But it's hard to imagine being anything more than I am. Nothing wrong with being what you are, but you're also allowed to dream. Well, what do you think I should be? Settle for what you already have. Form your own identity. Reach for the stars. You can be whatever you want to be, Demon. Cyber Demon doesn't know what he's talking about. My own identity? I can be more than just Demon? Yeah. But how do I do that? H how do they distinguish myself from every other person? <laughs> every other Demon? Well, how about a name, if you want one? A name? What should I call myself? Uh, if your dignity, uh... It it's your identity, uh, whatever you like. Hmm. Demon stopped and thought for a long time. Uh, how about, uh, Alex? Yeah, Alex, I like the sound of that. That's perfect. Pleased to meet you, Alex. Pleased to meet me too. Where? We talked for a while longer, discussing the many possibilities uh, that, uh, that are, uh, awaited us in our future. As the light dimmed, we made our way back to the teleporter to return to hell. Hey, zombie man. Uh, yeah. This was nice. It was. Maybe you should... Maybe you... Would you maybe... Um, 
want to go on the, on to the festival with me? I think you still have some soul searching before you start dating, Alex. I'd love to be your first date as Alex. Alex? <laughs> Alex looked confused momentarily, then smiled. Oh yeah, right. I was so invested in your answer that I almost forgot my new name. That's great. We can show Alex the kid uh, uh, to the world uh, for the first time. Uh, Alex beamed with pride. It's gonna be... Look, it's, it's gonna be great. I'll pick you up on the way to the festival. Sounds good. We headed back to the teleporter and went home. Oh dear, I hope I don't lose my testicles in a transporter accident. I barely got any sleep. I was so excited for my date with Alex. Oh. But then quickly... Uh, oh, is it still moving? Yeah, it's still moving. But when they uh, picked me up on the, the following day, they were quiet. I tried to start a conversation on the way, but they, they were distant. Hmm. I wonder what's wrong with them. We made it into the Watch Revenant's amazing trumpet performance. Everyone at the fest festival uh, seemed happy, except Alex. Hmm. Kakademia found us once the concert was over. Hmm. Kakademia found us once the concert was over. Yay, you made it! Yeah, you did a great job, Kakademia. So, are you guys here together? Well, uh, yeah. That's great. I'll leave you to it. Kakadima floated away eager to greet others. It's not quite H2, but I will take this game. <laughs> Alex, are you okay? What do you mean? You've been quiet. I thought we could enjoy the festival together a, a, a little more, you know? Oh, sorry. Uh, this is an awkward pause. Um... Uh, can we maybe just go outside for a minute? Sure. Okay. We found a nearby exit and snuck out. And, oh, oh, I thought that was me on the left. We found a rock overlooking a river of molten lava, consuming the souls of the damned. It would have been peaceful if it wasn't so nervous. Was Alex about to dump me before the, our first date even, oh, were, it was even over? Listen, you don't have to be here, you know. Huh? I know you're just being nice. You were just being nice yesterday. I'm just an average demon. That's all I'll ever be. What are you talking about? I'm excited to meet the new you. Oh, this new me is exactly like the old one. It's <laughs> with a coat of paint. Oh, I'll always be me. And you don't want that. Well, I do have two responses to that. Uh... First of all, don't tell me what I uh, what I want. <laughs> and second, of course, you'll always be you. How could you be anything else? It's okay if what you want is uh, is uh, shifts and changes. Expect to find out who you are. Distress screams echo through the distance. Alex smiled at the sound. Yeah. yeah, I am too. I think. We sat there quietly for a while, a happy, happier silence than before. Thanks, zombie man. For what? I, uh... Well, for making me accept myself. Didn't mention it. It was, don't mention it. Everyone needs to learn to love themselves. I'm gonna leave uh, room to love others too. But <laughs> I'm just going to uh, dick other things now. You were difficult though. Find easy ones. Alex put their hand on mine. Uh, Oh, I got a recording. Um, is this even real? Oh, thanks for playing our game. Yay! Well, I think we got all the endings. You got the Alex ending. Uh, did I even link this? Uh, I probably didn't, actually. I should do that. Um, let's see. Doomed. What's it called? Doomed. Uh, oh, I could just go back to the main menu. That'll probably help. Um, oopsie daisy. Um... Main menu. Okay. Uh, doomed love. That's what it is. Um, doomed love game. Uh, and let's see. Uh, here it is. I don't know why I didn't do this earlier. Here we go. Doomed love the game. And I'm going to look into it and see if there's any extra shit that I might be missing. Here we go. Um, oops. Wrong key. Um, here we go. Boom. 
Doomed Love is the game what we have... Well, I mean, we've finished it, but at least I think I have. Uh, I made a dating game where you can uh, romance the monsters from Doom. Doomed Love features four demons to date, five endings. Oh, there is a fifth one. All original art and music, and... Um, what's that last one? I can't really see it. Uh, absolutely no gore or violence. Okay. I wonder what the the extra ending is. Hmm. I don't know. What's what's the last little ending? I wonder. Uh, an unironically sweet little game, despite its ironic premise. <laughs> Worth it just for the music. Uh, fantastic job on the chilled E one M one before the samples kicked in. Uh. Okay. Um. Yeah, apparently there's another ending. Maybe uh, you can fuck up the uh, the date with the pinky demon. Maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not sure at all on that one. Hmm. All right. Uh, yeah, maybe let's just try fucking up that one deliberately. Um, yeah, let's see what we haven't done yet. Um, demon. Uh, go for a walk with demon. What's his relationship with Cyberdemon? Can't let Cyberdemon get to you, he's a jerk, don't listen to him. Well, I can't help it, he's the man around here. The icon of sin chose that guy to do the top jobs around here. You can't compare yourself to a guy with a rocket launcher for an arm. You have other qualities. Like what? I'm not even invisible. You're kind. Oh yeah, uh, great. Cyberdemon's, uh, it's a uh, fear from all those who oppose him. But at least I'm kind. I, I demand fear. Hey, cut that out. You have lots of qualities. At least you're not a bully. That's true. In some ways, I'm glad I'm not Cyber Demon. Mm, there you go. That's a start. Mm, okay. The point is that there's more to you than just being a demon. Um, if that's what you want. So you're the, you're the only one that's ever believed that za zombie man. But it's hard to imagine being anything more than I am. Nothing wrong with being what you are, uh, but we also allow the uh, allow people to dream. Well, what do you think I should be? Um, settle for what you already have. Yeah, you're you're right. Uh, I need to dream. I I no need to dream any bigger than I have uh, when I have everything I need right here. The stars reflected in demon's eyes, if only for a moment. We should check back home. We have a big day ahead of us. Okay. Uh, oh, nope, that, that ain't gonna work. Okay, we have a really big day ahead of us. We do. Thanks for walking with me, demon. Thank you, zombie man. Uh, I don't think I've seen any differences right now. Um, we teleported back to hell and got some rest. Oh boy, I could use some rest. I barely got any sleep last night. I was too excited for the Festival of Sin. The next day, I got up early. But I was waking up early, uh, what? Next day I got up early and headed to where it was taking place. Oh my god. Oh, the, uh, nobody's back again. <laughs> We're dating demons from Doom. It's, um, this is a game, but, <laughs> hey, over here. My friends are already, were already here, enjoying their day. Cacodemon and Mancubus appear to have made up. I'm so excited you're here. I am too. Everything looks amazing. Yeah, because of uh, many desperate, uh, many def uh, what? Yeah, because of, or maybe despite our best efforts. Good God, I can't read today. We all laughed. Oh, I'd better get going. Wish me luck, everyone. It's gonna get ready to doot. We all wished revenant luck, although they didn't need it. The crowd loved their trumpet performance. It was incredible. Afterwards, revenant met us on the dance floor. Ooh. Well, that's what I call murder on the dance floor. Uh, Revenant, uh, that was, Revenant, that was amazing. Oh, it was nothing. It wasn't nothing. All that practice really paid off. Revenant was bashful. Well, maybe you're right. But, well, you, you're going to get so many dates from this. Uh, not that we were able to get any for tonight. But don't you see, don't you see, Mancubus? Why we need dates? We have everyone we need right here. My friend smiled and nothing... Uh, but nothing more needed to be said. Besides, our dancing said more than we ever could. 
Hey, congratulations, you got the Friends ending. Thanks for playing our game. That's the fifth ending. We did it. <laughs> Zombie man. Oh my goodness gracious me. So that's a game, isn't it? Fucking hell. <laughs> Let's go to the main menu. Here we go. And there you go. That was Doom Love by Day David Cooper. What the hell was that? Well, uh, it was, uh, you know, it, it, it's kind of funny because it was... It was. It had more legitimacy than I was expecting it to have. <laughs> you take away all the the Doom characters in it, and it's, it's actually not bad. <laughs> Pretty good. Although at the same time, I kind of wish there were more Doom jokes. That would have been even better still. But hey, what can you do? So there you have it. That was Doomed Love, uh, a thing that exists. And I, for one, am pretty happy that it does. It's uh, it's a rip and tear and good time. <laughs>